all of this is political. Mm-hmm. This is not just corporations having these drops. All of this is political. When you think about how black women came to this country as enslaved women, you know, we were bred to produce babies and go back to work. Mm-hmm. We didn't have time to heal or recover. We didn't even have the chance to nurse our own children because we were the wet nurse of the slave master's wife. So there's already a genetic disconnect mm-hmm. from comforting and um, nurturing your child in your arms. So if we've been trained and taught that we're supposed to detach from our children, when you have your babies, those first couple of weeks, skin to skin, put that baby on their chest. They'll learn how to soothe over time because they know that you're supposed to be here. Our babies aren't supposed to be off in some room by themselves. Like this is medieval times. And we got servants who are going to, you know, check on them from time to time. It, it, a lot of things that are happening with our community is because we have been conditioned to separate ourselves. We have been forced uh, legislatively to go back to work quickly. Like there was a time, um, after I think World War I, where black women were at home. You know, bl- the family structure was together, everything was all in well. And white women were like, hey, I can't feed my baby. I can't, I can't go to my parlor and play bridge. Somebody got to come here and take care of this baby. Mm-hmm. So they passed legislation for black women to go back to work to do domestic work. So again, we we're detaching black women mm-hmm. from being a part of nurturing and comforting their children. All of that biological uh, deficit and separation plays into how we feed and care for our children. 